Hello, good afternoon. My name is Jeff Leung. Uh, welcome to our latest Law in 60 Seconds episode. Today, we will address your legal rights and obligations under the business contracts you signed that is being prevented from performance by COVID-19 pandemic and the movement control order. Until the government enacts a new COVID-19 law, you are essentially bound by the contract you signed. So check the contract, see whether it provides for a force major clause. And if, if it provides for a clause like that, then check the definition to see whether it covers uh, epidemic, pandemic, illness, government lockdowns, closures, or similar words like that that fits our current situation. If so, then follow that clause because it will spell out whether you need to give notice or force major event to the other side, whether you can ask for an extension of time, or whether you can uh, ask to be excused totally uh, from the contract. Uh, so it depends on what is written in the force major clause and every contract will have its own different versions of force major clause. So read your own clause carefully. And finally, what if there's no force major clause? Uh, you, can get, you can then rely on section 57.2 of the Contracts Act to say that uh, the current situation made uh, the original uh, obligation you agreed to perform to be uh, impossible to perform or through no fault of your own becomes unlawful to perform. You need to establish this and uh, the courts uh, will need to find that it is radically different uh, from what you agreed uh, uh, to perform originally. So it's totally different or substantially significantly different from what was agreed caused by the changes uh, arising from the COVID-19 pandemic and MCO. You can then ask for a frustration of contract uh, to, be, to be allowed and to be excused from, from performing the contract.